that, friends, is Bono, uh, whose new memoir, Surrender, is available now. Uh, Bono, uh, you know, we've had you on the show. We've had an, an incredible time talking to you right here. But there, there is something about interviewing someone for the television cameras with the standard uh, talk about their life, talk about the project, however beautiful the conversation may have been, and I really believe it was, that doesn't quite penetrate to the heart of someone and really plumb the depths of their soul. But the, the scientists up in Late Show Labs came up with a series of questions uh, designed to be a truth-seeking missile. Wow. Okay. Okay. To be, to be known, not as through a glass darkly, but clearly who you are. Mm. And it's called the Colbert Questionnaire. And I was wondering... <laughs> I was wondering if, if you might be willing to, uh, if you had the courage, really, to be revealed before the world. I do now. Yes. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. There you go. Mm. Yeah. Exactly. Exactly. I was about to say that. Here we go. Ready? <clears throat> Colbert questionnaire. First question, Bono. Bono, what is the best sandwich? A chip butty. It's a sort of chips, like, as in like Potato French chips. fries. French fries? Like French fries with butter on really plain bread. Grew up on them, love them, chip butties. I, that is the most Irish sandwich I can imagine. <laughs> it's potatoes on bread I know. with yeah. butter. That does sound fantastic. Yeah. That does sound fantastic. You know what that could use? A little more starch. Okay. <laughs> I'll take Bono. that as a cultural swipe. There you go. Go ahead. Go ahead. Take it. <laughs> I'm drink, I'm drinking now. Well, Things yeah, could get interesting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <clears throat> What's one thing you own that you should really throw out? Mm, um, mm. I think um, I can overdo um, the politeness. You should throw away the politeness. I'm starting to get the idea. <laughs> <laughs> what, what, Bono, is the scariest animal? The spotted paparazzi. <laughs> <laughs> Apples or oranges? Uh, lemons. <laughs> Said the bells of St. Clemens. Okay, have you ever asked someone for their autograph? Oh, Muhammad Ali. Oh, did you get it? And, and I, I have never told this to anyone. Um, I asked him f for his autograph and he drew a, a, a sort of picture, he drew a drawing. And I, when people ask me, for autographs. I do drawings all the time. People now turn them into tattoos and stuff, but that all came from Muhammad Ali when I asked him for his autograph. <laughs> what do you think happens when we die? I... We're, we're born. I believe that's... I actually believe that's when we're, we're kind of... We're born. That's when we begin. I'm... I'm can I stick with that? Yeah, sure, of course you can. These are labor pains, Stephen. Yeah, you'll be We're good going when you're finished. To... Oh, right. We'll have to talk about that later, too. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Favorite action movie? Anything with Liam Neeson in it. <laughs> so, so, I'm gonna say Love Actually. Of course you would. Sure. Richard Curtis is a genius. Incredible. <laughs> Window or aisle? Ooh. Well, it depends. Um, but, um, of course, the window. But, um, yeah, yeah, uh, the window. But if, if, I, if, if there's a body odor situation, the aisle. The aisle. Yeah. Because of the ventilation. Or just to get out. OK. <laughs> Favorite smell, speaking of which. <clears throat> Favorite smell. Oh. You know, uh, ooh, can I say this? Uh, are my mother ironing? Sure, sure. Mm. 
Least favorite smell? Mint. No, I can have mint, but not like chemical mint. You know, the... so minty fresh doesn't do it Oof. for you. Like yeah. toothpaste mint. Oh, I don't like that. <laughs> Am I to be truthful in these? Yeah. Do you wish <clears throat> to be known? Because I just, I do wish to be known. Then you should be truthful. By my father in heaven. I'm not sure about you. <laughs> just saying. Am I not your brother in Christ? Oh, who is my brother? Everyone is your brother. And not only that, but everyone is Christ. Love thy neighbor is not advice, it's a command, Stephen. So is do not worry. About a ting. Is every little thing gonna be all right? Don't worry about a thing. Does every little thing gonna be all right? I think between the two of us, you're the only one who could get away with singing reggae. Because it's a... You knew that Bob Marley sang in an Irish accent, don't you? No, I didn't know that. Cork and Kerry, yeah. Lots of people in Cork and Kerry went to the um, Caribbean. They were forced, indentured. Um, it's not the same as, as, as slavery, but it was still pretty rough. And they were taken there, uh, Cromwell, King James I, I think, and, and ended up, and there are still communities in Barbados called, um, I think they're called Redskins, Redskins, because they had uh, the complexion. And Bob Marley, he live in Irish town, don't he? Wow. I rest my case. <laughs> Check out your real situation. Good vibrations mm -hmm. all across the nation. That's a Cork or a Kerry accent right there. What's the One, most two, used three. app on your phone? Um, voice notes. That's where I write music or, you know, I'm in a bathroom mm -hmm. or whatever and I can't get to a guitar. Yep. Yeah, I sing. You don't keep a guitar in your bathroom? I thought the humidity would be good for the wood. The tiles are great for the voice. Mm. But um, so I sing in the bath, and but I do not play guitar in there, in that room. OK. <laughs> do you play the organ? <laughs> <laughs> drink up. <laughs> drink up. This is really working for you. <laughs> we got to take a little break here, but we'll be right back with more Bono, everybody. <laughs> 